live from Chestnut Hill, Massachusetts, near Boston, and Alumni Stadium on the campus of Boston College University. USC Trojan football is on the air. Tonight, Trojans meeting Boston College in the last early season non-conference game for USC before facing the rigors of almost steady Pac-12 play between now and the end of November. Speaking of steady, a steady rain has been falling here on the artificial turf field at Alumni Stadium. Hollering instructions out. Fakes the handoff to Davis. Throws over the middle back of the end zone. It's a touchdown. George Farmer, touchdown USC. The short field position set him up well with the nice punt return. And a throw, a screen pass. It's caught at the 45-40. Big running room to the 30. Needs a block. It's Buck Allen, and he'll go all the way. Touchdown, USC. Great call, great block by Vianney Talamavo and a 51-yard screen pass touchdown to Buck Allen. Halftime here in Chestnut Hill, Massachusetts. And the score, wake the town and tell the people, Boston College 20, USC 17. They're cheering the BC Eagles as they leave the field. Let's go, man. We're good, man. Let's go. Let's go, Nathan. Come on, baby. Let's go. Let's go, guys. Let's go. The throw, complete Aguilar at the five into the end zone, and it's a touchdown. USC. So they got what they had to get with 4.32 remaining. They'll hand it off. Nope, it'll be Murphy to keep, and he'll get the first down, and he'll be gone. 65 yards. They lead 36-24 with just three minutes and 30 seconds remaining in the game. and it is an onside kick, and it's fielded by BC cleanly at the 45-yard line on the Trojan side of the field. Clock under 10, they'll count it down here at Chestnut Hill. The upset, the top 10 ranked USC Trojans have fallen to the Boston College Eagles. 37 to 31, they're storming the field. One of the great wins in Boston College history. Credit to Boston College, we did not play a very good football game tonight. We didn't execute the things that we're capable of doing. Uh, and again, that is falls sorely directly on my shoulders. And uh, got to do a better job. Uh, I, I don't think it was for lack of effort. I thought we tried. Um, it goes to show you what you what can happen when you think you have a great week of practice and then you come out and, and you don't play great for whatever reason. So I've got to figure that out. Um, it's tough. It's hard. We've got a very disappointed locker room. Um, but I really believe we'll bounce back, and we'll do it in great fashion. Um, you know, we got back to the drawing board for the for the bye week, which is probably coming at a good time for us. Uh, and then we'll get ready for Oregon State. And um, you know, the the goal obviously of being Pac-12 champ, uh, Pac-12 champs, is still very alive for us. And we need to try to get to 2-0 in conference play.